With the Durafly monocoupe, we wanted more than just a scale high winger. We felt that it was important that the plane was also extremely respectable as a sport flyer, which has definitely been achieved. Quite capable of flying around scale, half throttle and looking the part. When you really start to wind it up, it's surprisingly aerobatic. It has the usual 1100mm wingspan, of course it's just a mere 4 servos. It takes a 2200 3 cell battery just like the rest of the range. It uses a 35mm motor up front for plenty of power. The monocoupe is typical of the kind of attractive looking high wingers that were coming out of the United States in the golden age of aviation in the 1930s. The Durafly monocoupe is a replica of the last monocoupe 110 to be made in 1941. This aircraft ended up with the name Little Butch. very little in terms of the basic aerobatic manoeuvres that the monocoupe is not capable of. It flies with precision, it's easy to fly, it's easy to land, it's easy to take off, it will hand launch, it does everything you want it to. The Durafly monocoupe looks superb both on the ground and in the air, and there's no doubt it will be a firm favourite with scale pilots but it's also perfectly suited to relatively new pilots who are looking for something that is well behaved, looks the part and at the same time will allow them to explore aerobatics.